What's going on, everybody? Welcome back. We are starting up pretty quick today. We are playing a five-color Ramos Dragon Engine deck, courtesy of Swenny Boy. Uh, Swenny Boy was like, hey, I want you to play my commander deck, and I was like, okay, let's do it. And then they were like, I'm five hours ahead of you, so it's got to be at 2 p.m., and I was like, okay. Sarov, what's going on? Oh, jeez. <laughs> oh, the horror fest has already started. Alternate timeline and who cares? Thank you so much for the resubs, guys. Really appreciate it. Welcome back. Welcome back while I was gone. I was not available, and uh, you guys resubbed, and I appreciate both of you. Okay, so we're looking at this <clears throat> this Prophet of Crufix. Wait, is Prophet of Crufix the... No, that can't be right. No, that's illegal. Why did he name it Prophet of Crufix, then? That's really funny. I'm trying to figure this out now. Hold on. Oh, Swanny boy. <coughs> I get knocked down. Thank you. Do it yourself, Prophet of Crufix. Oh, do it yourself, Prophet of Crufix. That's significantly different. Wow. You need to take it easy. King Lewigu, thank you so much for the reset, buddy. Welcome back. Welcome back. <coughs> I'm just so hyperactive in the morning, you know? Is Prophet of <laughs> Yeah, you need to take your Ritalin. Uh, just kidding. Do not do not take uh, prescription medication without a prescription and do not abuse things like Ritalin or Adderall. It's not good for you. Um, yeah, so I'm going to change the name because... DIY Prophet of Crufix is significantly. Um, the link also calls it uh, Puff the Magic Dragon, so I guess I'm just going to call it DIY. That's better. All right, that makes more sense now. Why is Prophet of Crufix banned in Commander? It's too good. Oh, is it untapped during every player's untapped step? Yeah. Okay, that's, yeah, okay, so you get five untapped steps. Yeah, that's pretty good. Yeah, I'm presuming you're playing a four player game. Well, I guess you get four untapped steps. Whatever. <clears throat> Alright. So we got Ramos. <clears throat> Dragon Engine. Six mana. Whenever you cast a spell, put a 1-1 counter on it for each of that spell's colors. So if you play Last Stand, that dude's getting five counters. And then you can remove those five counters to add Door to Nothing as mana. Is Door to Nothing as mana in Modern? No. Your commander? No. Why don't people play that? I would just win. I would just win. You can't even stop me. <clears throat> Alright, you got Enlightened Tutor. Brainstorm. Mystical Tutor. Vampiric Tutor. Worldly Tutor. A top and a soul ring. You see, good. you see any issues so far? No, those okay. are all pretty good cards. <clears throat> Cyclonic Rift, mm -hmm. <clears throat> obviously good. Demonic Tutor, Farseek, Rakdos Charm, Boros Charm, Dromoka's Command, Growth Spiral, and Simic Ascendancy. You know what this one does? Well, apparently it's a plus one plus counter on creatures. Whenever one or more one one counters are put on a creature you control, put that many growth counters on Simic Ascendancy. And at the beginning of your upkeep, if it has 20 or more growth counters on it, you win the game. Okay. So with Ramos, it's actually pretty good. You can be like, cast this, put five counters on it. Right, yeah, yeah, I got you. Repra replace a growth spiral with rampant growth, but that actually works worse with Ramos, doesn't it? Because then you don't get the, you, you get one counter instead of two. Let's do different things. Growth spiral draws you a card. I want to draw cards. That's all I want to do, Sarov. Cultivate. Kodama's Reach. Too good. Oh, Billy, what's going on, buddy? I was wondering where you've been. Anguished Unmaking and Vindicate. Both solid gentlemen. Or ladies. Whatever. I don't... Jory N, Ruin Diver. Whenever you cast your second spell each turn, draw a card. Uh, Dromar's Charm. Do you know what these do? The, the, I guess this is the only one Not with the Dragon's thing, Charm. No. You can gain five life. You can counter any spell or a target creature gets neg two, neg two until end of turn. Okay. <clears throat> Uh, Esper Charm, Jund Charm, Bant Charm, and Abzan Charm, and Sultai Charm. All the charms. Well, five, one, two, three, four, five out of ten. Chromatic Lantern, that's a solid one. Leyline of Anticipation, again, we can start the game with this bad boy in it. Okay, we're going to hold off while we go over this deck. Mizzix Master. You know what this does? Uh, Sort of. Exile a card that's an instant or sorcery from your graveyard. For each card exiled this way, copy it, and you may cast the copy without paying its mana cost. That's like a one-shot Yagmas will. Yes, except you can overload it for eight. And then you do all of them, right? <laughs> right. Past in Flames, Sky Shroud Claim, Steam Augury. Reveal the top five cards. This is like a poor man's factor fiction. 
you reveal the top five, you're, you, separ you separate them into two piles, and an opponent chooses one and puts that in your hand in the other graveyard. Uh, Rash me. That's a good card as well. Uh, Kess, Dissident Mage, 3-4, flying. During each of your turns, when you cast an instant or sorcery card from your graveyard, if you cast the card, this if a card cast this way, it would put, it's basically Snapcast and Rage every turn as a 3-4 flyer. Oh, Joda. Joda lets uh, Ramos cast any two spells with this remove five counters ability. That's pretty sweet. Aether Flux Reservoir again. Veldekin Vodakin Orgri again. Mystic Confluence. All Suns Dawn. That's pretty nice. You can return five cards. Yeah. <clears throat> I felt so bad somebody played Teamer since I couldn't tell you to play 34 lands, but also. Oh, okay. <laughs> did you not? Did you just submit it with like too few lands? Uh, Vivid Revival. Return to three target multicolor cards from your graveyard. So this is like draw five. This is a draw three. You can tell how like how things have gone downhill. Hypersonic Dragon. Hypersonic. You may cast sorcery spells as though they had flash. So a lot of flash things happen in here. Sylvan Reclamation. Five mana. Exile to two artifacts and or enchantments. And you can cycle this. Bring to light. Also pretty good. Um, Crufix. That's not profit of Crufix. As long as you're doing you new no maximum hand size, and if you lose unspent mana, that mana becomes colorless instead. That's pretty good. Urban Evolution. Everybody knows what that does. Last Stand. Target opponent loses two life for each swamp you control. Last Stand deals damage to target creature equal to the number of mountains you control. Create one one for each forest you control. Gain two life for each plains, and draw a card for each island, then discard the many cards. Lots of things happening there. Maelstrom Nexus. How come there's no All Suns Dawn in here? Not All Suns Dawn, um... Prismatic Lens. Prismatic Omen? Prismatic Omen. The one that makes all your lands, all the other lands. Look, King King Lumigu, that's exactly what I'm thinking. Maelstrom Nexus, the first spell you cast each turn has Cascade. <clears throat> Seems good. Tome of the Guild Pack, whenever you cast a multicolor spell, add one mana of any color. Alright, I'm liking all these cards so far. They all kind of let me do really cool things. Sunbird's Invocation. Uh, Merciless Eviction. Melek, is it Paragon? Play with the top card of your library. You may cast the top card of your library if it's an instant or sorcery. Whenever you cast an instant or sorcery from your, from your library, copy it. You may choose new targets. That's a lot of things happening. Thousand Year Storm, also good. Niv Mizzet, also good. Swarm Intelligence. Whenever you cast an instant or sorcery, <clears throat> whenever you cast an instant or sorcery spell, you may copy it. You may choose new copy to targets for the copy. Violent Ultimatum, destroy target through permanents. Three target permanents. Choose up to one creature, destroy the rest. Conflux. Search your library for a white card, a blue card, a red. Yeah, it's basically all Suns Dawn, but they go to your hand instead, and they're not in the graveyard. Then we have Sphinx's Revelation, Epic Experiment, Villainous Wealth, Expansion Explosion, and Supply Demand, all of which are pretty sweet. This deck looks sweet. How do you feel about this mana base? It looks like it has all the dual lands, maybe all the shock lands. Not all the shock lands, but all the fetch lands, rather. Okay, I just want to put these in another pile. There you go. I just want to be able to count all of these and hence see 20. And Floody Boy and Bloody Boy. Floody Boy and Bloody Boy. You guys ever heard the fable of Floody Boy and Bloody Boy? No. Well, you will one day. It'll be the story of your life. Go ahead, say it. No. You want to. I do, but I won't I'll restrain myself. Yeah, well, it's rare. Okay, so we're going to put these over here. There are 20. Okay, perfect. That's all I needed to know. Okay, so what do you think? Anything? I feel like Prismatic Lens, Prismatic Omen should be in here. <clears throat> I don't have that, though, so I'll just get it. I don't know what Prismatic Omen actually goes for. It could be like 13 cents or it could be like $8. It's so, magic is weird. 55 cents. Half a tick. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do at all. I'll just buy that. Yeah, Prismatic Omen seems like it makes everything a lot easier. Is it? Is it more in paper? Sarah, enjoy work. If you can do that. <coughs> Are you okay, buddy? So the one problem seen with this deck... Oh, God, here we go. ...is that there's like a lot of ways to interact with instants and sorceries. Right. But I wonder how many instant sorceries there actually are. That's actually I was thinking that's as soon as you said it, I was like, I know what you're gonna say, because it feels like your foot. Well, I guess there's a there's a good amount. <clears throat> there's also a good amount of creatures. I think it's something we'd have to like test first. All right, we're putting in prismatic omen. What are we taking out? <clears throat> I don't know, but it seems like a crime to play uh, pass in flames over Yagmas will. 
Really? Is Yawgmoth's will legal in... Yep. Really? Mm-hmm. Prismatic Omen's 18 in paper? I guarantee you that's because of... Wow. Do we play both? It could be like a budget constraint if you're trying to make it in a real life deck, because I think Yawgmoth's will is expensive in, in is paper, it? right? I think so. It doesn't feel like it would be, because it's just not that... <clears throat> like, people aren't doing broken stuff with Yawgmoth's will anymore. Oh, it's like seventy dollars. Yeah, huh. pretty pretty pricey. Well, that's the thing, isn't it? <coughs> Prismatic Omen is twenty-eight bones. Good lord. <coughs> uh, Legacy Q is up tomorrow when we're looking forward to it. Yeah, you guys just do it in the chat. I don't even. I I didn't even think about that. I it's probably so much easier for me. All right, we need one cut if we're going to play Yawgmoth's Will over Past, and if we're going to play Prismatic Omen. Well, we cut the Past for the Yawgmoth's Will. Right, that's why I need one cut. Come on. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. Again, I, I'm i not a fan of the uh, Vidalcan Ori, the four mana. Cause like, I'm not either. I, I never am. I don't know. I like Leyline because it can come into play in, on first turn, so it's just kind of better. better, yeah. Well, artifacts, it's not strictly because the other ones are artifacts. Artifacts are also easier to kill than enchantments. So, <clears throat> what is the goal with this deck? Is just five color good stuff, or is there a combo killing here? Can't see all the cards as clearly as I'm at on a work laptop. Um, <clears throat> I think it's just a bunch of cool interactive spells. Swanny boy can uh, the flash is super important in this deck. Okay. Well, as usual, that's not how you spell that, is it? How do you spell Ori? I actually don't even know. Why don't you just be do Vidalkin? Yeah. Because I try to use the word that will show up with the least cards. And this is going to show oh, wow. a bunch of Vidalkins, yeah. O R R E R Y. Oh, it's E R Y. Okay, like Matthew Orry, <laughs> but it's a different, it's a different spelling. All right, we still need one cut. Hmm. What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? BitConnect! No BitConnect? Isn't conflicts just like way too expensive? Eight mana? I guess it's only eight. I thought it was like ten. Plus you can cast it with like Joda. That's true. What's the card that says you can spend five mana to pay a spell? The, the non... Oh, Fist of Sons. Do we not want Fist of Sons in here? Because that feels just like a cheaper Joda. But Joda attack. Right, but like this is another this is just another redundant piece that like you'd want to. Well put we can't in add here. that until we cut one for the other card, so That's true. I'm just trying to figure out what we want. How good is Worldly Tutor for this deck? Worldly Tutor? I can see cutting ascendancy. You don't like Simic Ascendancy? You don't have that many creatures. It's kind of cool. You have eight creatures, actually. That's a good point. It's cool with your general, but it's also like pretty all in. It's commander. Commander, whatever. Cut brainstorm. Is brainstorm bad in commander? I don't actually know. Not with that many fetch lanes. It's not. All ten. All right. I'm gonna cut the simic growth. I agree. I, I agree with the the low impact of the card. I think this is fine. Ninety nine. <clears throat> so fun, 99. All right, we're going to head over to, uh, no, Constructed Open Play. Uh, we're going to do just for fun. We're going to play this guy. Format is Commander. Players going to be free for all buddies. Only my buddies, just watchers. 60 and one win. And I'm going to host this match. Uh, <clears throat> feel free to join in. We might do a three-player if uh, if it looks like we only get three. And I'm also fine with that because I like, We I feel like there's more options. Rob, feel free to hop on in. Jenny, what's going on? BitConnect! <clears throat> also, if you guys want to play, message me on Magic Online. Uh, my name is Frank Lepore with a space. And I will add you to my to my buddy list. And then you can join in the, the game.
I think I'm gonna start. Wait, yeah, let's start like this. I'm just gonna do two. I don't want to take too much time waiting for people, and uh, I like three players just because it gives you more, um, I you know more. What's real the word? estate? It gives you more real estate, but it also like it, it makes all of your plays a little more relevant. Uh, I will play first. Who do we got here? We got a Brago and a Chromat. Um, Prismatic Omen actually makes this hand pretty good. Makes it all right. You got a three drop, a four drop, a five drop. Yeah, I'll keep this. I'm gonna ju pernicious dude. Jeff, we'll definitely play another one if you're gonna be around. So, this could also make the games quicker than like an hour and a half as well, which is nice. Um, I'm gonna play this and just go get a a greeny boy. Probably a trap. Don't tell me what to do. Oh, wait. We can't get a trap with this. You think you can get any any dual land with any fetch land, don't you? You think you can Benny with Benny, 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 Boo. I'm going to add a Dagon M. Added. All right, sweet. I'm sorry, what did you say? I don't remember. Hmm. It was a while ago. It was probably yeah. at least seven seconds ago, so I can understand why your short-term memory would have failed you there. Yield until next end step done. White bordered. Come on. Let's get a greeny boy. Uh, we don't want to buy you. Let's get a let's get a trop. Just kidding. Savannah's probably fine. We're just going to play Prismatic Omen anyway. But if they kill the Prismatic Omen, we have to... <gasps> Can you imagine if you, like, force spikes this? It'd be so bad. What a, what a turd, dude. Happy birthday, Mike. Happy birthday, Mike. Michael, happy birthday. Michael, it's your favorite day. It's your birthday. How come there's no yield until my turn? Oh, a Felwar stone? Wow. Look at so many white borders. <clears throat> I was like... <gasps> do we just play this guy? That's the only thing we can do. So of course we do, right? I, he, you know he's playing white borders to troll, right? Disgusting. Rob is also a, uh, a Mana Traders subscriber, so if you guys are looking for ways to borrow physical paper cards or digital magic online cards, definitely check out uh, ManaTraders.com. With the link and the promo code in my description, you'll get 20% off your first three months, which is pretty sweet. Michael, it's your birthday. Happy birthday, Michael. You'll do this turn, too. Whenever you cast your second spell, unfortunately, we're not in a position to cast any. We well, shouldn't Veldic and Ori have flash. It feels like it's on. It's it's not on flavor to have flash or to not have flash. You know what I'm saying? Like it's gonna give your other spells flash, but it's it itself can't get flash. A little panty boy. Oh, I got a lantern over here. A panharmonica over here. Everybody's doing some broken stuff. We're drawing all the blue dually boys. Those dually boys are at it again. Also, the the Prismatic the Omens makes our bring to light better, right? Oh yeah, it makes our bring to light five all the time. Five alive, my Thank dude. you. Snoozle Moo, thank you so much for the for the resub, buddy. I have to translate this every single time. Why are you like this? I really appreciate this not being uh, anything ridiculous. <laughs> All right, it says Frank and Mike rules. Oh, it says Frank and Mike rules Mike. I don't know what the second Mike is for, but I accept. All right, so... We're done here. I guess we attack, right? I'm going to attack Rob. You know why? Because he's a bigger troll. <clears throat> I'm learning to play the Panharmonica. Man, maybe one day you can join the Panharmonic Orchestra. That would be pretty sweet. I grabbed a flavor deck, not a I'm totally fine with that. I, I don't I don't presume that any of our commander games should be uh, totally broken. It says Frank and Mike rule, happy birthday, Mike. Oh, I didn't see the happy birthday part. Oh, wait, there's two. 
Oh, look, there's two sections. <laughs> okay, so just to be clear, the translation for Happy Birthday, Mike, is Live Today Pleasure. Live Today Pleasure. So, hey man, Live Today Pleasure, buddy. Is that Japanese or Chinese? Because this is translated from Chinese. Oh, it's probably Chinese? Wow, I feel like I was just unintentionally racist. All the character languages, all the kanji languages look the same to me. <coughs> Josh, I literally posted about it twice in the Discord. <coughs> hey, man. Live today pleasure, buddy. I will. Yeah, but Discord, what does that mean? It's a, fu it's a fantastic tool for communication. Don't be like that. He's going to draw four cards. Oh, that's busted. Can we play Muldrifter and Modern? Yes. What do we get with, with Bring to Light? Whatever your heart desires. I don't know what that is, though. So that's why I'm asking. Does your heart desire a fish? N no, we don't even have a fish, Michael. What about a dog? Yes, my heart desires a dog. So now what? You can go get a dog. No, we can't. There's no dogs in our deck. Are you sure? Yes, I'm positive. Well. Oh, Maelstrom Nexus. You can get Kess and bring to light again, but we don't have the mana right now, right? Do you have to pay for the Kess? No, bring to light. Just cast play. instant or sorcery. No, I mean, I'm saying. Thank you. You still have to pay its mana cost, though, right? Yeah, it's like flashback. Right, but I mean, I don't, I don't have any more mana this turn. Maelstrom Nexus seems pretty good. Yeah, I like Maelstrom Nexus here. I don't. I can't see it though. Look with your Maelstrom eyes. Oh wait, you can't get permanents, right? Wait. Oh yeah, you can. Maelstrom, bring to light Maelstrom Nexus. That's what I always go for. Yeah, but you can only get creature instant or sorcery. You can't get. You can't even get. <clears throat> Are you been? Have you been cheating with bring to light? Why well, you can't get enchantments? You can't say that's what I've always gone for. As if you've done it a ton of times, when you've never been able to do it because it's not an enchantment. You little cheaty face. So no. you get creature instant sorcery? Yeah. So I think it's probably Kess. Actually, Last Stand seems insane, right? We control five of each of these. So we'll gain 10 life. They'll lose 10. They'll lose 10 life. We make five sapperlings. Uh, we draw five cards. Oh, we have to discard five cards, though. Oh, that's sad. That's fine, though. Is it? Whatever, man. I guess we'll do it. Choose target opponent. I'll choose T. Jesse. Choose target creature. Choose Molly Boy. Oh, that was our second spell, too. <gasps> oh, we're doing it. We're doing it. Discard five. Um, do we just get rid of all the lands? I think so, yeah. One, two, three, four, five. Because even if with even if with, even with Soul Ring we have Melek, is that we can cast the six drop. I'm just attacking them both. Is that right? Should I just attack them both? Should I do whatever you want, man? I don't want to. I don't want to. Uh, I don't want to make anyone mad. Do you want to make enemies or do you want to make frenemies? I want to make frenemies. <laughs> then yeah, you split it up. Okay, that's all. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> Sweating. <laughs> Man, the Urchai is just a cheater. More like the Ur cheater. Unbelievable. Don't forget the... No, I just... So here's the thing. Even though we had Ori out, when everyone's tapped out, I really don't want to... That's when I'd rather play my, my Incense of Sorceries because I don't want to face a counter spell. What does this do? It deals combat damage player. You may look at that player's hand. If you do, you may cast an online card in it without paying that player's... Eight mana for that piece of junk? I'm sorry. That was rude to the Mind Leech Mass. Do you remember that time you were a Mind Leech Mass and your mom was like... Frank, you have to deal with this mind leech mask that lives in my house. And I was like, all right, he can come stay with me. <laughs> Remember that? Yeah, I do. Man, those were the days. <clears throat> those were the days when I <laughs> ate the biscuits in the morning. <laughs> okay, so those were the days when you ate the biscuits in the morning? Mm-hmm. Huh. That's... I mean, that's, that's really what, that's special, what you were man. doing. I was, 
I was making a song about you. <laughs> no, F that. Pick one nerd to destroy first. Wow. We probably do want to cast Ramos as soon as possible. That's actually a good call. What does he cost? Six? What if Rikishi costs five? Why? Hmm. Because he has a lot of, of lot of color symmetries going on. So, like, remove five counters. You add f all five mana. Like, Frank, keep your drinks off the table. You don't want any tropical islands or underground tea. Tropicana islands or underground teas. <laughs> That's actually pretty funny. I've never heard that before. Those were the days when I ate the biscuits in the morning. That's a song. What are you doing right now? <laughs> Jesus. Okay, that's about enough of that. I like that you're just looking right at the camera. And you're like, I mean, it's hard to tell because you have glasses on, so your face could be pointing toward the camera and looking somewhere else, right? Like, it's the Casey Neistat illusion. That is the Casey Neistat illusion. That's why he wears those glasses. He's like, I can look anywhere. You don't even know. Those were the days I ate the biscuits in the... Mike is like your commander, Frank. You're not 100 without him. <laughs> yeah, let's go with that. Oh, man. Do we get a turn again? One, two, three. I'm just going to play this because it's just netting two mana, right? And then their next spell costs. Do we just play Melek Izzik Paragon? Izzik? How do we deal? Know. Is can you? How do we deal with this? It's blocking. It's got trample. Yeah, it's only a six six. We just chump with everything. Yeah, man. Oh, that sounds real bad. Four, five, six. Do we Maybe just... he won't attack us. He's probably gonna attack us because we're playing five colors. I mean, I just gonna pass here, right? Also, it's nice that we can rivet arrival. We can get back last stand, bring to light, and anything else really. Also, yeah, but I want to play. I want to play a card now, so I draw another card. So I'm gonna forego the fact that we have flash just for this one time, and then I'm just gonna pay it two because I want to draw the second. I'm not gonna give up a turn. What's totally holding you? Ca oh, sorry. What you say to me? What do you? What's letting you cast that? All right. Oh, Swanny boy. Actually, they might just go after Rob because we Rob has no creatures. And we have... And also, Rob has six cards. We have four. So, obviously, Rob has better cards than we do. Because, obviously, if you have more cards, they're obviously better. That's just how that works. Is it? Mm. No, we're playing all the colors, not just is it. Mm, okay. Oh, this is... I would totally attack you. Why? Oh, that's a good one. Because five colors is cooler spells. That's true. That's actually a good point. Those were the days I ate the biscuits in the morning. <laughs> yeah, see, it's an addictive song. Look, they're going after Rob. Knew it! See, once you throw some dudes down, you're like, hey, Rob. Wrecked, you stupid Mitch. Around that time, we got, we got, we tricked him into going after Rob. Did we trick him? Did we trick him? Or did it just kind of happen? Tricked him so hard, bro. So hard, bro. Are you seeing it? It's it's happening right now. What's he gonna get? He's just gonna get a wrath and wrath us. He's gonna get a wrath and wrath us. That's actually fine. I don't care about. I don't care about any of these creatures. We have vivid revival. Vivid revival. Vivil revival. Are you ready? Primordial into cleansing, please. <laughs> oh God, there's a planar cleansing in the graveyard. Oh, that sounds pretty scary, actually. Rob seems missing color. He's gonna need some cabal therapy to get out of this. Well, looks like Rob's in a pickle. Rob has to go to uh, Rob has to go to his cabal therapist later. How's he missing color? You know, I know. Blue oh, oh uh, I don't know. What's his commander? Oh, this is probably why Billy probably knows what his commander is. No, it's Brago. It's blue white. Yeah, it's blue white. Archaeomancer. 
And then you get Circuitous Route back. Okay, this is better than you playing Planar Cleansing. Whew. It was a Cabal Therapy joke. I got it. I, I elaborated on it and said he has to go to his Cabal Therapist. I got it and I improved upon it. Funny joke! going on you okay do you want it up here too so you can see it over here or you just like it here I see it just fine. okay don't get angry okay i can see it just fine don't make me hit you again can you sing that biscuit song again those were the days when i ate the biscuits in the morning i feel like you're i, mean, I feel like you're there's too many words you know but i think it's it still works, kind of. How about, Shut those up, were the money. days when I biscuit in the morning. You missed my 12-month resub bug, did I? Oh, De Denmark, thank you so much, buddy. Really appreciate it. Live live year blizzard. <laughs> wow, that's perfect. Perfect one-year uh, one year sub meme. Oh, look who it is. Way to, way to humble Brago all over us. Thank oh, you. He gave a trial. Look at this poor man's lightning greaves. Iodor, thank you so much for the sub. Really appreciate it. Welcome, welcome. Welcome, Schmelcom. <gasps> oh, okay, so wait. You can cast this from the top, and then we can copy it? Yeah. I think your whole body just exploded. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think we have enough mana to do that. No, it's free, right? The second copy is free. Well, the first copy. Oh, it's eight. I thought it was seven. Oh. Yeah. Or actually, not seven. I actually thought it was five. The three is hard to see. You just see all five symbols, and you're like, oh, that's clearly all it costs. Oh, that's one, two, three, four, five, six. We're actually one man away from getting, from drawing, from literally tutoring for ten cards. I didn't attack at all here. It makes me sad that I didn't do that. I got so distracted. There's so much going on. And whatever happened to those days we ate the biscuits in the morning? What did happen to those days? <laughs> those days are gone. I'm going to be honest with you guys. Mike hasn't seen a morning in, God, at least a year. Six months and counting. I've been watching your content since around TCG days on old MTGO with that sick poor report wrap. Thanks for all the laughs. Frank the Barbalus, thank you so much for, for the support. Really appreciate it. You are awesome. Welcome back. Welcome back. Those were the days. <laughs> oh, God. All right, it's T. Jesse's main phase. We're gonna leave. God, that confluence on the top makes me so sad, dude. We can play Crufix, slow to mana, then cast conflicts on our right, upkeep. Oh wow, I like that a lot. Dang, that was a that's a sick play, dude. God, I could tell you ate the biscuits in the morning, man. That is the one biscuit in the morning and play. Those well, were the, the days. Thank, uh, third try, not me. Oh, did he say that? Yeah. Oh, my God. I thought you came up with that on your own. I was so impressed. Do we really need a tutor for 10 cards, though? I mean, we get to keep them all because of... Do you need? Relic of Query. Relic of Query. Relic of Query? Tower of Relic Query. Relic of Query. When an instant battle team, we cast them to one target instant or sorcery card from that player's graveyard. Oh, biscuits. Whatever they target, I'm going to get back with Vivid Revival. But then we won't be able to two different cards. Yeah, it's fine. I'd rather them not play like last stand. Bring to light. Wait, if they cast bring to light, doesn't it? Doesn't it just get? They wouldn't get anything, right? Right, because it spent zero, right? Oh god, and oh god, and planar cleansing. Oh, that scares me. Do we have any recourse to this? I'm really afraid of like being able to play our spells when we don't have Prismatic Omen though. Like that seems bad. 
Maybe we're missing black mana. That's about it. This also hits multicolor cards. Like, we can't get back a Prismatic Omen, and that's pretty scary. I feel like I'm really dependent on Prismatic Omen here. Like, we have no black mana. Is that what you said? Yeah. Oh, boy. I guess I'm going to let this resolve. Maybe they won't cast it. Oh, they might not, actually. They might just... Yeah, they actually might not. They did not. Oh, wow. This is great. Oh, they did. Oh, this feels bad. This is less great. This is less great. We could bounce our own Prismatic Loans. Omens. With a Psychonic Rift. We can bounce what? We can bounce our Omen. No, it's Target Online for you don't control. We could just play crew fix though still. Dang it. Uh one, two, three, four, five, and a blue, and we'll just actually play top as no, we won't play top, that doesn't make any sense. We'll float one though. We could play top, but it'll just die. Those are the days. You ate the biscuits in the morning. I'm tempted to actually keep this because, like, if we play top, we just get to draw this. So we're drawing an extra card from the jury and uh, whatever. It's fine. Why don't you just wait until after it resolves that we get to keep the top? Because then we don't get to draw the other card. Why not? Because this will be off oh, the board. Oh, we did, yeah. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then it goes the colors. Whoa. I made a graph of my past relationship. It has an x-axis and a y-axis. <laughs> wow, that's a badger level old dad joke. Uh, for all the salt you make come out of others' eyes to the salty tears of your victims. Dr. Jeff Puff, thank you so much, buddy. Who is that man in the glasses? You know who it is. Who's that man? Man in the glasses. Who's that glasses man? Who is that glasses man? Wait, did they just cast this guy for zero accidentally? Because that's pretty gas. Uh, you will lose the... No, I won't. Oh, yeah, there you go. Now you figured it out. I was like, no. You will lose it, but you will not lose it. But you may keep it as well. That is how you summon Badger, yes. Uh, you just have to... Uh, once if you, if you say three dad jokes, then he appears. I think we're just playing Chromat on our turn. How's that sound? Playing Chromat on our turn? Dro Dromos, that's what I meant. I saw Chromat. I got scared. Is that... Did I mess up? Did I mess up too badly for you? Mm-hmm. Whatever, you nerd. Also, if we let that resolve, we couldn't play top because we no longer had Veldek without an Ori either. So, no. <laughs> I like it's just like all the things. We can still do all the things even after this... Planar cleansing resolves. Who cares about schmoopid planar cleansing? That's rude. You're being rude. Oh, I, I knew we were going to draw that. I so, so, I so knew it. We can't even play it, though. Why? We got two floating. We don't have any black mana. R Ramos? Oh, you're playing Ramos. I thought you were talking about No, black. we don't have eight for that. Sure, we do. No, we don't. No, nah, man, we got five, six, seven. You haven't had any biscuits this morning, oh, have seven. you? Seven. Yeah. Biscuits was my college nickname. My friends had asked me if I wanted an ookie, co an ookie cookie. What does that even mean? An ookie cookie? Oh, yes. Give me them counters. Come on. Here we go. Put them all on there. What are you copying? You copying your Azorius Chancery? Chancy! We didn't get any counters, man. I'm submitting a bug report. Excuse me, my Ramos didn't trigger his thingy lingy. His thingy lingy. And I didn't like it, even though it was a colorless card. So I guess I was wrong. Apparently, I would jinx people's decks by touching them, and they would say, "Stop touching my deck, biscuits." <laughs> uh, circle turn cookie last. One. Oh, crying out loud! Not okay. Yep. Sadly, I already knew that. Oh, God, that's disgusting. 
Well, hmm. this just went family, unfamily, family, family friendly real quick. An okie cookie, <laughs> a limp biscuit. Wow. Uh, Michael's whole life is all limp biscuit. Look, it's Crow Man. Crow Man, take me by the hand. What is this, would you say? Um, it's a Cronenberg. <laughs> it is a Cronenberg. How come when you target Chrome out with a spell or ability, it doesn't die because it's an illusion? How come some illusions are super weak and some are super strong? Are you a weak illusion or a strong illusion? Both. You can't be both, man. Sometimes I'm strong, sometimes I'm weak. I'm only human, you know? No, you're an illusion. God. Oh. Does Rob only play basics in his deck? Probably. Because he's a savage. You mean, you can't have probably without Rob. Nope. It's literally right in the word probably. I deny it. You deny what? I deny it. What do you deny? I don't believe in your science, okay, buddy? I really want black mana. Yeah, you and me both. Oh, black mana. Ramba lamba. Oh, black mana. Ramba lamba. Black mana had a child. Ramba lamba. Damn thing went wild. I like I like a sky shroud claim. We're going to lose the top forever and I don't even care. Draw a card. They need stupid top anyway. I don't. Who needs the quickie mart? I do. Boy, I hydrate. I'll stay hydrated. I hydrate so much that I'm dying. He is. He's dying inside. Let me let me let my spell resolve. Magic online. Let me let me let me. Oh man. Is this an overgrown? Is this Bayou? That's exactly what I wanted. It's funny that we've drawn three out of four. Uh, I guess we're not playing the Ravnica duels? No, we're not playing Shockums. Probably should. And probably should. Wow. I can't, I can't believe you've done this. I can't believe you've done this. I'm going to go with this Dovin Bond and just destroy him. I'm going to utterly destroy your stupid Planeswalker. Are you going to pick? You got something? rude can we do something about it what can we do it it mm -hmm. we can do it about it is what you're saying to me right now yeah yeah mm -hmm. meow, meow. Meow, meow, see? all right i guess you got it you got it you promised destruction on dovin why not just you know this is a good question i feel bad like i've let everyone down one, two, three, four, five, six. If we hit one land, we can confluence. If we don't hit a land, we can next. Oh, actually, we have crew fix. We're good. We have all the mana. And I have all the banana. Guys, my new keyboard just got here, and so now I'm typing out a long message just so I can test out the typing feel, and I've got to say it's pretty sweet. But the spacebar is pretty loud, but I guess that's okay. <laughs> you can tell it's one of those messages where you're like, I'm just going to keep typing just so I can make it. What did you say to me? Hmm? Pull that microphone close to the actual mouth. Mow. <sighs> okay, try this again. There we go. Gate Creeper. Oh, gatekeeper, keep on rolling, Mississippi Moon. Would you keep on shining on me? It's a gatekeeper, my Biscuits in the morning. I feel like the. I, I don't even know why I stream by myself when you're not here. <laughs> it's all you, man. You are the. Why don't you pull the mic closer to you? Well, so what you, do you mean? Oh, you, it's literally on a on a very very flexible stand. I can't see well. Oh, that moves. Everything moves. Oh. It's completely customizable. Oh. Look at that. In every way. Wow. Oh, my God. Wow. Yeah. You can pull it. 
Down this way too. Look, everything everything moves. Look at that. You can face it wow. directly into your mouth in any direction. Wow. You can face it into your mouth in any direction, Michael. Wow. I like the winky does. <laughs> Would you say it's your favorite? It's my favorite winky does. What's a winky does? <laughs> You know, I said it, but I don't know. <laughs> that's oh, that's just all Winky does. He's here, he's hanging out. Who are you attacking? Rob again? Oh, Dovin. Dovin's got to go, man. You can't be having planeswalkers on the board. Is this why there's so few planeswalkers in? Yes, they get attacked. Yeah, that makes sense because then it makes you feel better. You're like, I'm not really attacking you. I just want to get your planeswalker off the board. Try resolving a Jason Mind Sculptor in a four-player commander pod. It'll resolve, but it'll die instantly. <laughs> you get one activation. It might as well be a sorcery. Thank you. Yeah, pretty much. Mm. Bob, thank you so much for the reset, buddy. Really appreciate it. Emote of Mike's face in those glasses or Riot. Actually, that's a really good idea. I think it's it's probably the best. E it's a really good emote idea. Yeah. I'm going to be real for a moment here. I had the first generation of that keyword, and I was very disappointed after less than two years. Keys were double tapping even after multiple cleanings and slowly <clears throat> slowing Windows key press. It was super frustrating since I the I hope you have the better luck than I did. Oh, no. Copy a triggered ability you control. I mean, Blech. with Panharmonica, this is... That makes sense. But but What's wrong with you? <laughs> I'm just making a little frog noise. Is that what you're doing? Yeah. Oh, look. we Look at that. God, we're very good at this game. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We have ten mana to do with whatever we want. Oh, oh. Mow. Mow. We could Cyclonic Rift here. Um, yeah. Mow. You like that? I just like playing um Complex. I think so. Maelstrom Nexus. Are you think what are you looking? Are you just pressing your eyes? You know, like looking in a different direction, messing with your eyes with the glasses? What are you doing over here, man? Nothing. <laughs> Do you need your, your Ritalin? Do you need your, your ADD medicine? <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We have ten mana. Do we just call Don't hate because I'm woke. You're not. You're literally sleep. I ain't sleep, boy. I ate my biscuits this morning. Oh, dear God. You know, the funny thing is they tried to wake up at 1130, go get sushi. Didn't work out. No, of course it doesn't work out because you say I almost set my alarm for one and then you roll out of bed at 140 and I don't understand. Well, I actually set an alarm for 1130 and then, and then oh. I, I gave it up and set another alarm for 130. <laughs> Why is it so hard to just get out to just get out to just get up? I don't understand. I don't know. It's just a weird it's just weird, man. It shouldn't be that difficult, I'll be honest with you. Uh what do we get here? I like Mystic Confluence. So start for a white card, a black card. How to click cards in your library, then click do and done to put them in your hand. This is actually a lot of decisions. Yeah, you're right. I wasn't ready for this. Oh, we should have played Ramos first, is what you're saying? God, Ramos is so expensive, though. I just want to do things. If we cast out, if we get rid of this, does Ramos come back? No. That's stupid. <laughs> it would only work if you let it stay under that. I didn't really, they didn't ask me. Sweaty Boy says Ramos comes back. It's weird. Oh, sweat. This is this is too much. This is decision anxiety. How about Sunbird's Invocation? We already have Maelstrom Nexus. But we don't have it in play. So, let's get Thousand Year Storm. Okay. I clicked it. Now what? Yogmoth's Will. Yogmoth's Will? Oh, mm -hmm. I like that, actually. Um, Now what? I don't know. Yeah, this is a lot. This is a this is a real. Let's get Farsi because we can cast it now. 
And we want more lands, I think. Buy an ultimatum? Really? We don't have double black, though. Leyline is great. Interesting. Jota could be good. That could be our white card. Yeah, Merciless Eviction, just in case. I don't want to choose one of those, though. I want to choose them all. I do, so since I can't, I'm out. For that reason, I am also out. What about <laughs> Dune Blast? I guess. Whatever. Um, That could be red, that could be white. You know, let's actually put this guy back, and let's get Mystic Confluence. I do like that better. We don't have a better counter spell, right? Mystic Confluence is like the only counter spell in here, right? Yeah. All right. Dunzo in the Bunzo. God, I really hope there's a... Oh, there is. There's got to be. Uh, What are we getting here? Swamp. I'm sorry, what did you say? Swamp. There's no, there's no swamps in our deck right now, buddy. Is that not a swamp? Where? Right there. There's a Badlands. Yeah, which is a swamp. That's not a swamp, you... It says swamp right on it. <sighs> you stupid Mitch. Get chickens so you can Sunday. That's, all, that's actually a solid idea. Get chickens on Sunday. Get tutors so you can... You can do tutor for five tutors so that you can... Yo, dude, I heard you like tutors, so we put tutors in your tutors so you can get tutors later. And then we can miss the confluence for another tutor. That seems good, right? Man, so many tutors. That's the joke. Man, I feel like I need a Rainier Wolfcastle meme where he's like, that's the joke. Tutors in your duders. <laughs> if you if you have if you have never vamp tutored to get a demonic tutor, you haven't played enough vintage. Is that true? Is that a thing? Ronan Lamb, thanks so much for the for the sub. Really appreciate it. Welcome, welcome. I'm waiting for whatever's happening here. Yeah, it's called demo. Have you ever demoed? <laughs> Look at our hand. This is the most, this is a really powerful hand. Have you ever bobered for a scrober? One, two, three, four, five, six. No one's ever done that. No one's ever done that, Michael. So, so we can play this, and then we can play a land. So we'll have seven mana. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and we can get Soul Ring, Prismatic Omen, pretty much whatever. We should play like Thousand Year Storm first, though. Or yeah. Maelstrom Nexus. What are you doing? What aren't I doing? Hmm. Probably not Maelstrom Nexus, because this is only the first spell you cast each turn. I'd rather play Thousand Year Storm. One, two, three, four, five, six. And we have three left over. If we hit a land, we can play Joda. Oh, can we? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, we can probably play Joda and Thousand Year Storm. If we have the mana for it. Colorless. So green, red, blue. Green, black, blue, red. I think this. I think the bayou and the forest are going to make it rough. Maybe not. We'll have to figure it out. Maybe we should have gotten rid of these creatures. I don't. I don't really feel comfortable with what's happening over here on T Jesse's side. There's a lot. Of, there's a lot of creatures up in here. You're right. Oh. Well, at least it's not hoof. Hmm. Yeah, I guess that's. If it was hoof, you'd all be dead. This doesn't. This has defender, and this is just game to play. Oh, it has haste. 
Yeah. Oh, this is the old Aurelia. That's why. Oh, that's no good. They get two combats, right? Yeah, that's pretty bad. Why are they only attacking with one? Oh, they're, they're not. not. Are we dead? Is everyone dead? No. Are you sure? Dude, you got 50 life. This is a lot of damage, my dude. I mean, it's a lot, but I don't think you're dead. I don't think you know how magic the guy... I think Rob is dead for sure. Rob's probably dead, yeah. We're at 27. Rob's at 13. Right. How do we deal with this nonsense? We just, um... Three, four, five, six. We have Cyclonic Rift, I guess. Yeah, we do that. Oh, that, that's going at Rob. We're taking 20, so we go to 7. Yeah, we're fine. 7-11 makes the biscuit boys in heaven 7-11 makes the biscuit boys in heaven TJ is normally a pretty even player and will keep both of you alive so long as possible just to toy with you both and do more cool things are we dead? Oh. So they decided to keep Rob alive. Oh, all right. Well, that That's was... fair considering we just tutored for five cards. I guess, but I, I thought we'd get another turn at least. How do they deal with 50 damage? They have eight. They have like 30 power in creatures, man. They get to deal 60. That's not fair, man. Well, I'm leaving. I will concede the match. That was not ideal. I guess we should like even if we tutored I think we for, dirtled too much. We definitely did dirtle too much, but I feel like this deck is leading me down the dirtle path. It just makes me want to dirtle. <laughs> the path of the dirtle is yours. I hit play. I don't know what that's going to do. I hope a window comes up and lets me cancel out of it because I have no idea. Oh, it's just. Is it the same as host? That's weird. Anyway, feel free to join in, guys. Oh, I assume Rob is dead as well. Very soon. Oh, no, he's dead. I'm sure of it. Not sure if I'm still welcome. You guys are totally welcome. All you did was play creatures. That's totally fair. Yeah, the two combat steps and the... When you play Aurelia and and Crater Hoof Behemoth in the same turn... Oh, it wasn't Crater Hoof Behemoth. You know what I mean. I don't want to say it's a new name because I can't even think of it. So I'm just saying little, it's basically just... Little Crater. Little Hoof. When you play Little, little Hoof and Aurelia yeah. in the same turn, it's pretty good. All little your guys hoofy. get plus two, plus two. And there's like five dudes, so that's ten. But then you're getting two combat, so you're basically adding 20 power to the board. Plus the three from Aurelia and the seven from the Hoof, so that's another 20. So you're basically adding 40 power right there before even accounting for any other creatures. This is the same dudes. I'll do it again. I'll run it back. I don't have a want or ever play EDH. Well, you are that is, you are welcome to do that. Can I start the game? I'll do it. Hey, wait. Oh, biscuits. Dang it, Mitchell. Ah. I miss you too, Elk Tears. This was quick though. We can probably play one more after this. Wish you were here. Have you read the description? I did. I actually checked it out the other day, but I wasn't. I can check it out right now, actually, because we're going to another game. So, okay. Main goal is the deck is to make Ramos' ability to, mana, to make mana during each player's turn. Play spells with enough colors to stack up five new counters on every turn and utilize the abilities. They can only trigger once each turn. I One of the things I do in Commander is I underutilize the Commander. That's 100% true. Um, I see. Okay. Uh, and utilize the abilities that can only trigger once each turn, such as Maelstrom Nexus, Rashmi, Eternity's Crafter. Eternity's Crafter? What is Eternity's Crafter? I don't know. Oh, that's her name. Rashmi, Eternity's Crafter, and Jury, and Ruin Diver on each oh. player's turn. Some of the most important cards making this possible are Dr. Ori, Leyline of Anticipation, and Hypersonic Dragon will just you cast your non-entrance instance as though they have Flash. So these are some of the first cards you should try to tutor for as long as you're hitting lands that have spells to cast in hand. Card draw engines such as Nimbus at Perrin, uh, Tome of the Guild Pack, Rashmi, and Jory and Big Draw Spells such as Stinks as Rev, Explosion Expansion, and Conflicts, or Card Recursion. 
such as All Suns Dawn and Vivid Rebirth. Oh, this is a nice use of the semicolon in this email as well, buddy. Uh, all are very important to keep the machine running. The deck is also running a slight cascadish theme with Mouse and Rexus, Rashmi, and Sunbird's Invocation, which makes it so that you can cast a bunch of spells each turn, putting a bunch of counters on Ramos. Okay, so Ramos is the central part of the deck. It's not just a five-color commander. That's good to know. Uh, I will keep this hand. Hey man, you gotta you gotta pop out that other guy. Pop out that other guy. Boop. Pop out that other guy. Pop on bro. What? Hmm? What would you say? What? What are you doing this? Hmm? Okay. Always a pleasure. We have a blue. We need a white, a black, and a red. Unfortunately, we're going to have to connect it to green. Do you mind if I shamelessly promote my stream later? Your stream? You have your own stream? Oh, Abzan and Jun Charms lets you instantly put five counters on Ramos. That's actually pretty sick. We did talk about it, but it's not your stream, right? That's why it was that's your wording. I was I was just poking fun at your wording. It was just a joke. And no, obviously I don't mind. A little squirt. Yeah, bro. <laughs> like, like a snack today. Oh, hilarious. Actual hilarious. This has all been a long con. Octus has been planning. Befriend you via stream, meet you in real life, get invited to your home, then take all your subscribers. Hey, man, you mind if I promote my stream? Uh, no, man, I didn't know you had one. What are we getting here? Uh, Savannah. A uh, Savannah? Hypersonic. Electronic. So now we need either, uh, we just need any land here. Any land will do. Why does Ramos cost six? It's so expensive. Did you hear what I said? I heard you. Walk beside him in the kingdom of heaven. <laughs> well, kiss my crippled ass. That's from Forrest. What's that thing? Whenever Spin Crusher blocks, put a 1 1 counter on it. Remove one one counter on it, it can't be blocked this turn. Okay. This seems broken, right? This is a card where someone's like, it's just a spin crusher. And then you're like, like I'm going to move all my counters to this thing and then do this thing and that thing. It's unblockable. It's got a million counters, you die. This is pretty good with uh, old, old zombie priest, man. Old zombie priest, man. Mm-hmm. I mean, I hate that we're going to do it, but we're going to brainstorm to find the fourth land. I mean, we're going to try to do that. Well, yes. Probably going to fail. Then be brainstorm locked. Forever. Forever locked. Mm. Happy birthday, Mike. Happy birthday, Mike. Love you bits. Love you two bits. You love my two bits? Yeah, I love... Everybody loves your two bits. Remember the time you were eating biscuits in the morning? Eating b -b 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 biscuits. Sacrifice another creature, Blood Bairn. What's a bairn? Is it like barn? <sighs> yeah, it's like barn. First strike, trample, and haste. Is this deck less powerful, or is it made to, made to make me feel like it's less powerful before it does some broken shit? Who knows? Well, I don't. That's what I'm asking. I don't. Knows. Uh, I know that general generally leads to combos. So you should probably not let his commander resolve. Yeah, I'll stop it from resolving. Do that. Okay. Good job. 
Yeah, nobody said kills commander the moment it hits the board. Just let the bodies hit the board, okay? Are you talking to me? Yeah. What else would I do with it? What, what are you looking at when you look over there? Let me just look off to the side. I'm just looking places. Oh, jeez. <laughs> oh, oh, this is Rob. Oh, all right. I thought that was T. Jesse. Because th that's how it was before, so now I'm just confused. What were you doing there? What? Oh, God. <laughs> Don't worry about me, man. I got all my biscuits. It's really hard not to worry about you, though. I got all my biscuits? Is that mm -hmm. what you just said? I may have. I don't think you've had all your biscuits for quite some time, dude. Quite some time. Who's that biscuit, biscuit lady? Is that how the song goes? Yeah. Oh, we did it. Oh, we're not even brainstorm lock because the land is this, boy. I'm going to put Last Stand and probably Thousand Year Storm back. Yeah. If it's got to be one of these two. I guess we're going to draw one of them. Give me that Thousand Year Storm back. Gonna go back in time. That's for Back to the Future. What are we getting here? A scrubby boy? We need a red source. Volcanic, plateau. It's got to be a volcanic or a plateau. Probably a volcanic. Yeah, we technically need double blue. White friend. J -j 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 Joda. How, long, how much does this guy cost? Six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Well, that's awkward. Oh, wait, hold on. This is interesting. Are they. Is Rob just dead this turn if he doesn't have an answer? I think Rob is dead. <laughs> Or I think mean. T. Jesse is dead. Oh, God. Because they sack this to this. It comes back. They remove a counter. They sack it to this. They remove a counter. That's infinite. Yep. This is, what's, this is what we were afraid of. I mean, we have a blocker, thankfully, but... It's not my job to hold up removal. I got a blocker. I can't not do anything. I'm the only one with nothing on board. T. Jesse has... Oh, wait. T. Jesse doesn't have a blocker. Yeah, but so T. Jesse probably just killed T. Jesse. Yeah, this is... Why is this a thing? Why is this a thing in Commander? This format's worse than Vintage, man. <laughs> Definitely not. Also, T. Jesse has a previous history of killing Rob, so I assume they will, they will battle it out on their own. Shall I just scoop so you don't have to click so many times? <laughs> yes, please. <laughs> well, no, because I don't play MTG anymore and I misclicked. <laughs> oh my god, that's gas. Oh, this is great. Fantastic. Wow. The game goes on. Oh, and he just kills a planeswalker? Look at this. Fantastic. Everybody works. Rob does have a history of being a convict convicted felon. <laughs> That's where he learned all his commander smarts. In the clink. Yeah, they play a lot of commander in the clink. Oh, this counter is a spell? Yeah. I didn't know that. Even though we went over it before the stream. Hmm. Look, man, if I don't get my biscuits in the morning, okay? Does anyone want to Does anyone want to Uber Mike some biscuits? Some Uber Eats Mike some biscuits? No, please don't. Why? Because that's ridiculous. What's ridiculous about it? You want your biscuits in the morning. You just said it. It was mainly a joke. Mainly, though. Don't talk to me if I haven't had my biscuits in the morning. <laughs> what? Is it a joke because, you know, coffee in the morning? Do they have to be banana biscuits? No, I don't even think that's a thing. <laughs> Are you sure? Because it sounds interesting to me. Just because it sounds interesting doesn't mean it's a thing. That's not the prerequisite for being a thing, just so you know. So I'm just saying, are you sure? No, you're dead to me. 
Wow. Yeah, wow, well, I was right. I mean, you can use bananas to make bread, so you why can, not make biscuits? When at? pizza's on a bagel, you can have bananas anytime, Michael. <laughs> Wait, when pizza's on a bagel, okay, I follow that. You can have bananas anytime. Nope, doesn't make sense. Doesn't check, doesn't, uh, doesn't do the thing. God, where's our mana? Bobby Butter's Belly Rumbling Biscuits. <laughs> Oh, Lord. Did you attack? Yeah. But now you can't block. Why not? Because you attack. Oh, this is a human. Why does that matter? Because this guy says whenever a human deals damage to you, destroy it. Like, who knows that's... Oh, I didn't know that. Exactly. Like, why does it have that text? Well, that's unfortunate. I also keep thinking this is T Jesse and not Rob. I don't know how that matters, but that was not worth it. <laughs> Definitely not. Oh, we could have actually. Oh my God, we we just punted twice. Why? I'm so bad at Commander, guys. I'm so sorry. I oh, could have got rid of the Commander. Yeah, we could have gotten rid of Machaeus and because uh, we were going to do that anyway. But I just wanted to wait till their turn so we know exactly what we need to do. Like if they're just going to attack T Jesse, then I'm fine with it. I'll just leave it alive. But. We're still going to do that, but we could have saved our, our Jota. I just want to cast Ramos and just start going to town. That's all I want to do. Big birthday banana biscuits. Because Dark Ascension was a fun and interactive set. Hey, man, that's it, Ed. Uh, you know, Lingering Souls and Huntmaster of the Fells. Are you ready? Brother Bob's basketball bus. Okay, now you're just being ridiculous. Quit while you're ahead, man. You had you had a good one. So maybe we ban charm it. Why does that matter? Because it puts it on the bottom. So if he doesn't have a thing, he's just gonna get wrecked. He'll just not put it on the bottom. They don't get to choose. They have to have a preset, I think. <laughs> this is some moto shenanigans. <laughs> Oh, they sacked it. They're good at this game. Should I focus on finding a huge mistake I can make somewhere to make you both feel better? Focus on death. You should be dead. <laughs> That's fair. Shred memory. Search library for a card at the same card of mana cost or reveal it put in your hand. I would also recommend drawing some lands. That's my preference. What are you getting here, Chief? Hey, Frank and Mike. Honesty Stream. What were some of your favorite kid shows growing up? Specifically, slightly educational ones such as Barney and Friends. Doing your for going coming shoot. Thanks. Sesame Street. Bill Nye, the science guy. Sesame Street. Picture pages, although it's awkward to like picture pages now. I also like the Magic School Bus. Don't go back and watch it now, though. It's not really a good show. Why not? It's just not. It's just not good. Unless you're a child, then it's probably fine. <laughs> I assume that's who is watching it. Yes, I assume that's SWAT what Cats the... isn't educational. <laughs> In no way is SWAT Cats educational. SWAT Cats is good, though. It, it just, was, yeah. It was Pretty definitely sure. not a. Uh, this is not an educational program, though. The whole the Netherlands, wow. Clapcaker, what's going on? Time to get your crayons and your lanzels. Land. That's like a land. It's a slow land. It is. A very slow land. It makes me sad because, like, the turns are so long, right? Like, everyone's doing such broken things and just like, oh, no. Oh, God, no. 
Picture pages, picture pages, time to do your pic. God, Bill Cosby, why? Why did you have to be a scumbag? Now he's a jail scumbag. <laughs> yeah. How long is he in prison for? I think it's like four years. It's probably the rest of his life. Uh, three to ten years. Yikes. SWAT Cats was amazing. It just wasn't educational, which was kind of the point of the topic. Buddy? Uh-huh. I will cut your eyes out. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's scary a little bit? A little bit. Oh. <laughs> I feel like went through the glasses and I stabbed you in the eye. And then we had to go to the hospital. Yeah. Okay, guys. We'll see you later. Cut the stream short because I stabbed Mike in the eye. Wasn't there a reboot? Oh, I could see that. I don't think there has been yet, but... Flying in haste? God, this guy just wants to do broken stuff. Wow, okay. I see what you're doing. Shell, what's going on? There was a Kickstarter the last had an upgrade in 2017. Good lord. Why does it need a Kickstarter? Why wasn't it just popular enough? It was with a K, wasn't it? Yeah. Oh, man. Shut up. You don't know. I knew, man. I knew, man. Well, it hit its goal. Yeah, $141,000 at a $50,000 goal. They hit they three times their goal. So why... What's going I mean, on? Probably takes a while to. Look at this sweet Soren. Oh, that looks like that looks gas. Why don't all cards look like this? That is pretty cool. We're gonna just deliberately make our cards look worse because we. Because we can. It's We've been your five hand. years since that Kickstarter. Come on, man! Somebody put up. Here's the results. Why am I watching Squat Cats right now? Well, do you think that's what you'd be doing? You'd probably be sleeping right now. Land. La 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 land. But I'm here streaming. But I'm here streaming. Well, that's not good. I'm almost tempted to draw two just so we can hit lands. Yikes. Six mana, six mana. We can play this, but again, like, with only... You don't like drawing two here? Our options are Hypersonic Dragon or play one of these other spells. I'm going to draw two, my dude. Picture pages, picture pages. I wish I saw wasn't in my hood. I want to draw some lands right now. Yeah, look, did it. No, 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 nailed it. Nailed it on your knees. My job has run me through social media like crazy, and I came across a popular tweet someone shared stating that Cosmo was in the middle of purchasing a TV network and was only indicted because the people of Jewish heritage didn't want him airing TV shows that put African. Oh my god, that's just. That's that's insane. Oh god. These are all cheaper than the real versions except for Teferi that's hilarious cuz they look amazing. This looks fantastic. Do you remember the time I I drew, I drew two cards to draw a land and I hit a land? Good talk, man. I'm glad we had this conversation. What? Oh, God. Why are you like this? Is it possible that you even know? Do you even know why you're like this? No. You really need to look into... Is oh, this Gary. Each huh? opponent? Yeah. Wow. 
That's a commander staple right there, boy. It's a good one. Why don't we have that in our deck? Because it would suck. Like you. <laughs> How dare you. I'll, I'll kill you. Will you? Will you kill me? Yes. Oh, yeah. Kill that Grim Haru Specs. Yeah, four Garys would be pretty ridiculous. Gary! Okay, this guy's playing Planeswalkers McGee over here. What about Planeswalkers MacGuffin? That's not a thing. You just made that up. Dang it. Oh, boy. Land? Land again? Land again? Remember that time Rob almost killed somebody, but then he messed up, so now he can't <laughs> do anything for the rest of the game? Oh, Lord. I do remember that time. What is this? Five, six, seven, eight to kick that, that bad boy? We can also play Jory N and Dromir's Charm this turn. I think this deck needs more mana acceleration. I do, too. That's my, that's my big concern right now, is that I feel like we're almost missing... How many lands are in the deck? Like 37. That's a good amount. Yeah, that's plenty. We have, cult, we have both of these and this. And Chromatic Lantern. And Farseek. Like, this is not nothing. Yeah, maybe just bad draws, I guess. Draws. I think we play one of these two. I think it's probably Sunbird's Invocation here, right? Hmm. Why don't we just play Ramos? That's what I'm talking about. You always forget about that. I do. This dude's on eight. Because I kind of want to just kill it. Like, I really don't want them to have Soren ultimate. He has a secret ultimate, too. What's the secret ultimate? Target life player's total life player becomes ten. Target life player becomes ten? Are you having a stroke right now? Yes. Okay. He can literally just make anyone at ten whenever he wants. Yeah, that's why it's kind of scary, right? So I want to kind of play Jorian into Anguished Unmaking. Could do that. <laughs> Target total life players become 10. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Billy, gifted sub to shell. Thank you so much, buddy. Really appreciate it. Welcome back. Or welcome. Oh, wow, it gives you a little YouTube preview now. Dude, I don't, I don't know what to do. You guys think we should play Ramos or Sunbirds? I really think we should just get this Soren off the board. Yeah, I think I agree with that. So I'm going to go one, two, three, Jordan. Thank you. And then we're going to take four from it, which is kind of rough. Shanala, thanks so much for the resub. Welcome back. Ten months. That's a good amount of time, my dude. Oh, we hit another land, too. God, we're good at this game. I don't even have to fetch for it. Time to get your crayons and your biggles. Your biggles. Oh, that's actually pretty funny that Anguished on Making got rid of a Soren. That is a <laughs> that is actually on point flavor right there. Do you have a problem with your biggles? Yeah, only because they don't schmiggle enough. Which is a common problem. Is it? Mm hmm Sounds like it's a common problem for you. What are we discarding here? Mizic Mastery, probably? Yeah, we're pretty far from that. Well, five, six, seven, eight. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We're one mana away. Yeah, pretty far. That's not that far. Whereas if we discard, like, a Dromar's... You probably get rid of the stupid dragon. Also, Doom Blast doesn't look that great here. I was thinking of Doom Blast. Thousand Year Storm seems both of these seem like really strong. Uh, get back in the gamels. Get back in the gamels. Let's talk about my gamels, Michael. You can't stop me, buddy. I was born to stop you. Where are you?
Time to get your crayons. And oh, this emblem is something. What does it do? When you never land it enters the battlefield under your control, you draw a card. Yikes. Dry Builder. And then you can draw a card. Man. Uh oh, Rob's doing something. Is he going to kill this Smoldrotha? Oh, got him. Why is my nose itching? I really don't like it. It's probably exfoliate. I'd probably need to exfoliate. I'm going to have six here. Is it almost our turn again? Did Rob like do nothing? That's great. This is great. This is Commander the way God intended. All right, next time we're going to Ramos. Ramos? Ramos! We are going to Ramos. What can they get back with uh, the Eldest Reborn? They can get back Joda. Uh, oh, they can get back one of their own Planeswalkers, which is pretty good. And then they can actually replay the Eldest Reborn from the graveyard. No, they can't. Muldroth is gone. Okay, we're doing all right. Are they going to strip mine one of our lands? No. The answer is no. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Remember that time you were like, it was pretty far from casting this. <laughs> yeah, like you had to draw land. So we can copy Anguished on making Bant Charm and Brainstorm and Doom Blast. Nah. Just play Rami Boy. Cast. Rami Boy. One, two, three, four, five, six. Wish we had one more mana. All right, we did it. I'll have to work. Catch the rest on the YouTube side of the video here, future me. I don't think he's going to get that. Attack Robert. 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 Hey, man, you know about Robert? Bird trigger storm. It's cast. What does that mean? God dang it. What happened? He friggin' played stupid dumb card. He played Vendetta on my Ramos. That's rude, man. How could he do that? This is why I don't play the commander, because I feel like it's so easy to get rid of your commander. And it's such a huge man investment. Like, you basically take your whole turn off. This is almost why I like decks where you just have the, the commander is the only, the only purpose of the commander is to have uh, a color identity. Well, there's no real Commander Protect in this deck either. There's no, like, Lightning Greaves or anything like that. Commander Protect. Oh, yeah, so you're saying these go together. Right on. Uh, if we can draw one land here or, like, one two-mana spell, we can play a six and a three or a six and a two. Okay, so the Elder Shivorn got back Jace. They're playing with commanders to play around it, or you can get Greaves and Boots. Greaves and Boots and Greaves and Boots. I'm just, I feel so demoralized when I want to play my command. Oh, all right, hold on. Do we use this? Sack and Enchantment. Do they have two Jaces out? My god. All right, so no, we're not using this yet. That is a two-man spell, emblem? though. Uh, whenever they play a land, they draw a card. Whenever a land goes comes into the battlefield, enters the battlefield, they draw a card. That's pretty good. It's not bad. Command, commander attack, commander protect, but most importantly, target total life players become dead. <laughs> wow. Oh, got wrecked. I think to draw two cards off this, broken. Yeah, he has nine cards in his hand. Is that all? No. Oh, okay. Wait, yes. Oh, all right. What do you do over there? What do you do over there? Well, you I just do this thing. It's like me here. Look, it's me on the stream being like this. Just staring away, all, all, like, for no reason. So I'm just trying to figure it out. I'm just, it's fine. I just, I'm just wondering what's going on. I don't know why I do it. Okay. 
just do. I don't know why I just do. Which is better to play? Probably Sunbird's Invocation, right? Yeah. 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 Yes. Yeah. Yes. 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 Stop it. Do I Dromer's Charm something? No. But what about Counterspell? You're right. I just want to draw a second card from Jurian, which I think uh, is really... Uh, it's my greed. My greed! Uh. Wow, look at look at Gonti. He's like, I'm going to hide behind the Spires of Arezka. Wow. I don't know why you're copying and pasting that, but all right. Are you using slobs? No, I'm just using OBS. I've always just used OBS. Draw two cards and lose two life. That's like... That's some baby shit. Wow. Where's your skeletal scrying, bro? Where's your... Yeah. Skeletons. Where's your skeleton scrying? You don't know about skeleton scrying? Yeah, I know what skeletal scrying is. You exile okay. the cards and you draw the cards and you lose the life, man. Where's your nec necropotence, as they used to call it back in the day? People actually pronounce it that way? Yeah, it was real weird. I'll play my Nick Crepidence. I'm like... I'll draw 16, 17 cards. 16, 17 cards? 16, 17 cards. Huh. Uh, OBS with two monitors, correct. Oh, what is this? I'm going to counter this. How do you feel about that? Yeah, I don't want that guy around. Blue. It's not really a bug. It's just the way it's programmed. It's a feature. It's a feature, correct. All right, so we're going to take a point here, go down to 27. God, this City of Brass has really just been murder. I'm going to free spell, though. Um, we, uh, we can't cast any of them. We got no free spells. Dang it. Yeah, it sucks. Then you die. I thought you revealed until you had a spell. You no, cast. you reveal the number of cards equal to its casting cost, and then you also can cast a spell that costs equal to or less than it. Uh -huh. So it all revolves around the casting cost of the card. That's So, like, Drunk's Command costs three, so... You reveal three, and then you can cast a card that costs three or less. For this, you reveal six, and you can cast a card that costs six or less. Sunbirds, fun birds. Sunbirds, fun birds. See, that was rude. Why would you do that? You ain't hurt nobody. They're going to kill my Sunbirds on vacation with eight cards in their hand. Probably. Remember when 30 minutes ago Rob could have killed opponent? I remember. <laughs> oh, I, I misclicked because I'm bad at magic online. All right, that's fine. There ain't no creatures on the board anyway. Why did you bounce this if you're just going to play Phyrexian Scriptures? That's interesting. No attacks. Just protects. Just... That's pretty good. Just around the river bend. Just around the river bend. Probably going to play Dragon. One, two, three, four, five. And then we have five left over. So we can play Jory and Hypersonic Dragon and keep up Drunkest Command. Let's do that. And when you cast the spell from... Oh, it's whenever. It's not even the first spell. Yep. Ooh, biscuits. One, two, three... Jordy N. I always yield to this. Come on, give me like a far seek. Esper charm? Oh, destroy two cards. Are there any enchantments we want to destroy? Do we just want to get rid of Phyrexian scriptures though? Why? Because we're gonna have two creatures on board. A fair point. I guess we also have Dromoka's command. Yeah, let's draw two. 
Urban Evolution and Electronic Hypersonic. Hey, oh, Prismatic Element, Kodama's Reach? Yeah, I'm, I'm game for that. Uh, let's get a Swamp, because we literally still have no natural Swampums. And probably just a Forest. Put you in play. Play from the hand. Resolve, little Dragon Boy. Just around the Dragon Boy. Here we have a Gross Swamp. Oh god, we do have a Gross Swamp. Why didn't I replace that? That's awkward. I'm feeling really uncomfortable You filthy right savage. Oh, they still have Spires of Araska. That's annoying. Maybe they'll forget. They won't. But maybe. Nope. It's possible. They didn't. Low chance. Do I Drogus Man make them sacrifice their scriptures? Yeah, we do. Put a 1-1 one, one counter on a creature. I just want to sacrifice my scriptures enchantment. Choose target player. I'll choose you. And I'll put a counter on this dude. White. And white. What are the odds we hit a two mana spell? It's low. Oh, but we hit a demonic tutor? What? That's pretty good. That's gasoline. Oh, God. Oh, God. The sky is the limit, boys. We can get whatever we like. It's going to go to the graveyard. Maybe we just Yawgmoth's wheel here. All right, so we want to play Ramos, right? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. We have 12 mana. Ramos is going to cost 8, so we'd have 4 left over. That was insane. Wow, what a hit. I agree with you. So it's going to be Ramos and a 4 mana spell. What's the best four mana spell we can get? Actually, it might be three mana. I think it's three mana. So, go get a land. I don't think I'm going to do that. We could actually just play Sultai Charm. That actually might be good. No, uh, Abzan or Jun Charm, right? Those are the ones that put the counters on it. Right. Yeah, we're going to get the Abzan Charm. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. So it is 12 mana. Okay. Because this is 5, 6, 7, 8, and then 9, 10 for the drone. One of these came into play tapped because we had a Kodama's Reach. That makes sense. Okay. Okay. What did you tutor for? It didn't reveal for me. Must be a bug. Remember that ghost car? Are you a ghost car? You're really creepy. Why? I think you know why. Black Tutor search for anything seen on Yes, that's the that's the joke. That's the joke. Look how red my arm is. Yeah, that's because it was like on the thing. Man, this game could have been so much shorter. I'm actually fine with it because we actually got to do things. I just want to do things. Do 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 things. Do 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 do. Give me a sec here. Oh God, he's got some broken stuff. So one, two, three. Two, three gets him seven. Eight, nine, ten, eleven. So he has eleven mana. He can play whatever he likes. I always cap these and, and finish them off, but then I'm like, oh, there's still a little bit of juice in there. I can just get that. Probably. Maybe the joke was bugged for me. That is a possibility for sure. What'd you say? Papa needs his juice. Here's Papa. (laughs) 
so it's so bad. These glasses are just amazing. God, dude. Okay, they played a Lingering Tormentor, Fear and Persist. Oh, the Persistent and Dying cancel each other out, doesn't it? So that's another infinite thing. Yeah, but it doesn't currently do anything. You can do whatever you like. Oh, I played under Swamp, which turns my mana, it turns my Culling the Weak. Oh, God. Are we dead? Calling the week. What? 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 Okay, now they're playing a Micaeus. Still fine. Still fine. Oh, no, that could taste. I mean, you both have blockers, though. Correct. It's probably going to come after me because we have... He has a Death Toucher, and we do not. I can't imagine we're dead because they have... We have blockers. Wait, this guy has feet. No, that's not... Oh, that guy has Trample. Uh, so one of us is dead. Oh, yeah. and this also gives Flying with another mana for that. Let's see if he messes up again. It's very possible. You can do whatever you like. I would say don't misclick, but that would actually make them uh, probably less inclined to misclick. So. On our turn, we can go Ramos and play Abzan Charm, and then on their turn, we can go either one of these, which is pretty sweet with the Ramos mana. I'll scoop it up if you want to come my way to hurry things along. Two people are dead here? How are two people dead? Oh, me and you. <laughs> I don't know about all that. I don't know how Rob dies here. And I want redemption. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, we're definitely not dead. We got this. If Rob's going after TGSC, then we are good to go. Get him. Get him. Isn't that not big enough? Not yet. It will be. You understand? Do you understand? Are you scooping or no? <laughs> I don't know if I can trust you. Yeah, I don't want to be like, hey, do I have to just make it? All right, cool. All right. Well, the emblem is, I like the emblem is still there. It's like, this is still your. This. Even when you die, the emblem stays. That's how permanent emblems are in magic. All right, now we just iconic for this board and win the game. Well, I don't think that wins on the spot, dude. Might as well. It might not well as well. It might not well as well. Do you understand? I don't, actually. You casting that bad boy? Yeah. Because then we put two. We play this. Oh, yeah, yeah, It yeah, puts yeah. five counters. Then he makes ten mana. Then we can play anything. And plus we get to Sunbird, my dude. For like 700. Sunbird, Funbird. That's my favorite day. Oh, no, the Pleasant Valley Sunbird. 
Oh, that doesn't trigger this guy? Oh, from your hand. That's stupid. What a bunch of hot trash. <laughs> I don't like Commander. I'll frag. I had the time of my life. Billy Joe Armstrong. Where is, uh, where, when, did I quote Green Day? Look, we, we had the same, from hand, dumb, we had the same realization. Uh, I'm going to attack. You don't have any floaty boys, and these are, this is not a human. I can pretty much guarantee, so. I'm going to cast this now to show two 1-1 counters. On Ramos. Look at the nice part is we don't actually have to tap our City of Brass for once in our lives. We're like City of Ass. <laughs> City of Ass, huh? Oh, we, we whiffed this time. Give me them counters. Ooh! -wee. A little bit softer now. Instant. Instant. Yes. Your sorceries are all shenanigans right now, too. Excellent. Something, something. Instant speed. <laughs> Wait, we can't you like conflux and get all the counters back and then keep going? Get all the counters back? Yeah, because it'll put more counters on them, right? Yes. Oh God, yes, yes. Excellent. Should I just block just for for the lulls? Should not block. I'm going to add mana. I'm going to add ten thousand mana. One, two, three. I'm going to put five more. Oh, wow. We get the Sunbirds for eight and we get to Ramos. Woo. Oh. Vindicate a stupid thing. We could just miss the confluence something. We could just vindicate, vindicate the, the trample chariot and then just chump block it. Sure. This is ridiculous. Oh, we can only use Ramos once a turn. Why did you suggest this to me? I didn't know about that. That doesn't matter. We can still, um, we can still cyclonic rift and get rid of the chariot. Oh, we're casting one of these, aren't we? Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna do this. I think that's fine. We still have a cyclonic rift, just to be clear. And Jorian draws us another card. And then we got a rash me, and we got a copy. <laughs> oh boy! But my wagon. I don't care about your wagon. Wow, Ramos being able to do that only once a turn is that's just stupid. What a terrible card. <laughs> Let's get Yogmos Will for sure. Uh, do we just villainous wealth for like a million? Yes. Yes. Excellent. Mystic Confluence for safety. Um. Doesn't matter. This game's done. File an ultimatum. File an ultimatoes. Okay. And then merciless eviction. Sure. Last stand. Last stand. Done. File an ultimatoes. Let's go to the blocks, and I'll just block here. Has undie. Dead or no? No, I'm. I get the block. Oh, he has Rogue's Passage? Oh, well, I guess we're going to have to use this then, aren't we? How do we do that? How do we do that? We have two mana floating. Oh. Complex costs eight, not ten. <laughs> Pass, please. Okay, I'm going to pass into blocks. Oh, I get to lose my mana. Dang it. All right, fine. I'll bounce this idiot. Pshaw. 
Hey, we hit a top. <laughs> like you do. That's pretty solid. I've never been that scared of a Nantuko, a Phyrexian ghoul before. He's back. Watch out. Swamp Thoughtseize, have a have a good afternoon, buddy. Now he has flying again. That's okay, that's not that's not trample. But they do have a rogue's passage, so we have to deal with that. God, we get so much mana. Oh my god, how much mana is this? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 22 mana. 23 mana. Check my new kicks, yo. <laughs> oh. Do we just villainous wealth for like 22,000? Yeah, let's do it. X is 20. Ooh! Storm and Mastery? What? Why can't we do this? Why can't we just fill in this wealth? This is our whole deck, right? <laughs> so we'll just put like, does it matter? Band charm, put that thing on the bottom. If he dies, he dies. Um, though there's a salt tide charm, not a band charm. Oh. We can still destroy the monocolored creature, which I think is fine. Excellent. Something, something, dark side. Oh, we could have given Ramos double strike. That's true. How big is Ramos, though? 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. That would have killed him. You know what? I have a feeling with all the spells we're going to be casting off Rob's deck, we might still be able to do it, so... Draw another card. Oh, also it had on dying. So there's a lot. This is a lot. This is a lot going on. Cast this. Cast this. Uh, Eye of Doom. Each player chooses an online permanent and puts a Doom counter on it. Cast this. Zulaport Cutthroat. Cast this. Soul Stinger. Cast this. Exile a permanent. Cast this. And I don't care about that. You do that for 20 and that's all you got? It's not. Yeah, I was like, sadly unimpressed by that. Did you just hit a bunch of lands or something? I guess so. All right, I'm going to always yield to this Ramos trigger. Maybe that was a bug? You're a, there's no bug. Put a negative one counter on target creature you control. When it dies, you put a negative one counter on target creature for each negative one, negative one counter on Soul Stinger. I'll oh, put two negative one, negative one counters on it. Sure. It's just going to go on itself. What are we choosing? I'll choose this stupid top. We're almost is only 16 16. This guy can't have counters put on it. <laughs> Tatterkite. Oh boy. I mean, on their turn, we can just violent ultimatum or literally anything in our hand, so. What's commander damage? 21? Yeah. Oh, 
we're so close. What is this? This is 21 right here. And they're 25, so we're about four shy. Oh, I thought we chose our own permanent. <laughs> that's, oh, that's not, that's not how that works. Uh, let's pay two life, sacrifice a swamp. Do I have a way to sack creatures here? I don't think so. I don't think so, but we can just go to their turn. It's during their upkeep. Let's do some shenanigans. Oh, I do not have a step. It doesn't matter. We're on the draw step. So we got 10 mana here. Yeah, this guy blocks. This is just two on the blocks. Here's a weird question. It doesn't matter. My hand is stacked. Like, we can just last stand and gain a million. This guy also can't get pumped. Like, it's not like it's a... Uh... You wealth for 20, hit 5 spells. I've literally drawn all lands. How did that happen? Well, you suck. That's why. Got him! Wow. I do feel like you want more ways to get, like, Ramos out sooner. Because Ramos feels like the engine of the deck. Um... What is there to do, though? Like, you have Cultivate, you have Kodama's Reach. What about, like, Worn Power Stone? It's colorless, though. Yeah. Like, you, I can see why you don't want a ton of colorless cards as well, because of uh, Ramos himself. This list is charming. If Flux Reservoir seems unnecessary. Yeah, this does... This I, I agree, actually. This does seem kind of unnecessary, because, like, it feels like if you're already going off, you don't need either Flux Reservoir to, to do the deed. I can see adding a Rampant Growth here instead, just to have one more way to get, um, like, a, a land into play. Felwar Stone, also an option. Um, Bloom Tender's interesting. Um... I don't actually hate a Bloom Tender. Do I not have a Bloom Tender? A Bloom Chicken Tender? Is it one word? It is two words, and I don't have one. I think that's actually fine. Everything else seemed good, though. Like, I really... I think the deck is really strong. I think it's just a matter of, like... You just have to get going. And if you can get going, I think you're in good shape. Agreed. Play Snowlands and the Snow Rampant Growth. What is the Snow Rampant Growth? Is that a thing? A bootleg Famicom? Oh my god, you guys are maniacs. Oh, Living Wish. Sounds good. Alright. Um, Everything else is... I literally had no... Like, there's no cards I was like, I don't want to... I wish we didn't have this, or I don't really want to draw this. Everything else felt really powerful. My literal only complaint was that I, I wish we could just get started faster. Like, I really want to go from two to, like, four. Or, like, three to five or six. Like, that's really all I wanted to do. Yeah, I don't know. This deck was sweet. I actually had a good time. I, I was wondering about Rakdos Charm and, Dr and Jerogus Command, but they do destroy enchantments and artifacts, which is relevant in this format, so... Also, being able to exile a graveyard is super relevant. Yeah, that sounds good, too. And just being able to fight a random creature, all seems good. Would you play? Would you consider playing? I actually have that. Uh, I have this mono green deck that I was going to play today. If this is the one you're referring to, I don't know if this is the same one. This is the only one I could find, and there were several versions with Trinisphere and like Monvoli Acid Moss and Primal Command. So let me know if that's the one you're referring to. But. Um Yeah, so anyway, I, I like the deck. I think this deck was sweet. And um, you have any any thoughts? No, I thought the deck was good. I mean, I, I actually wondered what, if we needed Chalklands, but it didn't really feel like it because we already... I think Prismatic Omen actually added a lot to the deck too. Prismatic Omen and Chromatic Lantern are both very, very good. 
But um, I would probably have the chocolate just because of the fetches. It makes the fetches way better. I agree with that. Um, Sometimes you need double colors. Do we have room for ten though? Sure. Yeah. You just got a basic of each and add the. Oh, it's not that many. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There's only ten basics though, so like we'd have to cut all ten of the basics, which makes things like cultivate Kodama's Reach far oh, see. Oh, sure. So like you're gonna, you're actually gonna, it's gonna get worse if you do that. That's true. You'd probably have to rework the mana base. I don't know. But that's hard to do too because like, twenty of your thirty-seven lands are shocks and or duels and fetches. Command Tower is obviously better than anything. Exotic Orchard's probably better than anything. Yeah, usually. Mana Confluence is very good. Reflecting Pool is very good. So this is another five. So like, what we have twelve? <clears throat> we have ten basics. Reliquary Tower is necessary. So I think you're either playing like five shocks and cutting five lands, or just playing none. Yeah, and, and like even with even with those shocks, like you still have the duels, you still have um, a lot of five color lands, which I think is totally fine. Yeah, this deck was sweet. I actually had a good time, and um, I liked all the cards that I was playing. So, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, if you're watching on Twitch, I'm not going anywhere. If you're watching on YouTube, uh, definitely slam those like and subscribe buttons. Check me out at CoolStuffInc.com. I'll have a new article up going. Uh, it'll probably be up by the time you watch this, and you can use Frank Five for five percent off and uh check out manatraders.com you'll get 20 percent off your first three months with the subscription link and promo code in the description and also check out meundies.com slash frank for 15 percent off along with free shipping and free returns all of those are great deals if you're in the market for any of those services or products so check that out um yeah thanks for watching if you guys want to have your own decks critiqued by me or play it on stream uh there's links to do that in there's a, there's a descriptions to do that in the patreon and twitch links below so check those out and uh thanks for watching guys really appreciate it